this will be a quick video going over how to install your high beam, low beam switch on the back side of your firewall. Now this is your dimmer switch that will be attached to the firewall. And now I will go over the wires and which wire connects to which post. So starting off, your left hand post is your high beam wires. And your center post is your power terminal. And finally, your right hand post is your low beam wires. Going over your wiring diagram, this will be attached to your main harness and it will be attached to 17, 18, 19, 20, and 21 wires on your main harness. Now, 17 is your blue two way tracer, that's to your horn steering column. Number 18 is your blue three white tracer, and that's to your high beam switch power terminal. Number 19 is your red three white tracer, that goes to your high beam switch high beam terminal. Number 20 is your black two white tracer, and that's for your high beam switch low beam terminal. And finally, 21 is your blue no tracer, and that goes to your high beam switch high beam terminal. It is now time to connect the wires to your dimmer switch. First, we'll start on your left-hand side, which is for your high beams, and your high beam wires are your blue wire with no tracers and your red wire with three white tracers. Moving on to the center post, this is your power terminal, and the wire that connects to there is your blue three white tracer. And finally, this is your right-hand post. This is for your low beams, and the wire you connect to it is your black two white tracer. Now I'll go over the various components needed for this install. These two bolts right here, and they are just a flat head screw. And these will come with your dimmer switch. This right here is your retainer ring. This will go around the dimmer switch on the interior of your Jeep. And you also need these two small little bolts that will go through these two small holes and the larger hole will be used for one of these larger screws that will attach directly into your dimmer switch. Now install your dimmer switch onto the back side of your firewall, pushing your dimmer switch through the firewall. Now on the interior of your Jeep, you have to push your dimmer switch through the firewall and now we will secure it with your two flat head bolts on the top and bottom and the top bolt will hold on part of your retainer ring. Also thread through your two smaller screws to hold on your retaining ring. And that's how you install your dimmer switch.